Hey everybody, welcome to this video. I'm Minx Laura123 and in this video I'm going to be showing you how I make my hair look colourful and wild, okay? So basically I went into this shop, it's a local shop in South End called Mixtures. I always go to Mixtures, love the stuff they do. Um, and I bought these clip-in hair highlights, okay? So I'll show you them individually in a minute, but basically there they are, all different colours. And yeah, I got this idea actually from a fellow YouTuber called Natalie Nightwolf. She's one of my favourite YouTubers, by the way. I love her videos so much. And she did a video, she's got long dark hair like mine, and she was putting in all these different clip-in extensions, all different colours, and it just looks so cool. And it's a way of kind of, you know, making your hair look different and colourful um, without having to use hair dye and stuff like that. So um, what I'll do, I'll put the link down below to her video that she did and please go and subscribe to her channel because she really is awesome, okay? Uh, but yeah, I'm really excited to do this. So I'm like, oh, this is fun. So let me show you uh, the different colours that I've got. So I have um, like a bright yellow colour. By the way, this one was 179 so it says fashion extension, 100% um, synthetic fiber clip in. So that's that one. Uh, then I've got this one. This was 199. This is bright red. And it's a bit thicker than that one, so that's why that one's a bit more. Um, but yeah, really nice bright red color. And also got this lovely blue one. This was 199 as well. Look at that. That is a really nice blue. And my favorite color bright pink oh yeah pink is my favorite color so got that one and that was 199 as well so I've got that um, but I also got these um, which are in their own kind of separate packaging and if you look so basically on these they've got at the back you can see there they've got like the little clip in thing um, but these are different these are kind of like slides like they kind of just I mean they're still clipping in but they just got a little bit of a different kind of top bit um, you can see there the difference so they just like slide in um, and on here you've got all the different colors as well so there's pink orange green you've got yellow blue uh, I think there's a red one I'm not sure but anyway <laughs> but yeah you can see what I'm talking about yeah uh, so what I'm gonna do now is brush my hair I have my little rainbow brush here I like this brush and I'm just gonna basically put them in and just make some like funky you know styles with them you know um, I mean obviously I've got all the different colors but you could you know just for you know per se if you like the blue one best you could get two blues or whatever and just kind of have one color or you could mix and match different colors i mean it's literally up to you you are in control of what you do with your hair so i'm just gonna brush my hair through i dyed it recently as well so all my gray roots have gone which is good i like that and in case anyone wonders i use um Schwarzkopf live hair dye in black Okay, so that's just a little brush there. I love this little brush, it's so cute. Look at that, it's like a rainbow, and it's got a little unicorn on it as well. Anyway, right, so um, I'll do the pink one first, just because it's my favorite color. I did have a scissors here, but I don't know where it's gone. So I'm just gonna hopefully open it without a scissors. Hold on. Can she do it without a scissors? Yes, okay. Right, so, ooh, look at that, it's a lovely colour. It's actually really nice, like the feel of it, like it feels really soft and that. I'm just going to unclip it from here. Okay, oh yeah, that's a lovely colour. And as you can see at the back, there is the clip. So you literally put it in and then you just click it like that, look, like that. So, okay, I really need a mirror to do this. I've got my little thing in the camera, but it's not as good as an actual mirror. So this isn't like a professional way of doing it. It's like a rough kind of way. So I'm just gonna lift my hair from at the top and then I'm just gonna kind of put it underneath, okay? So it's a bit difficult without the mirror. <laughs> Is that in properly? There you go, that's pretty cool. 
So you can see just literally within a second you've got obviously a little bit of a different look. I mean I've done that really quick but you can see I like pink and black together though. So I'm going to just unclip it and just slide it out. There we go. So then I've got the blue, which I've got to try and open again, out of scissors. I know I've got my scissors out, it's somewhere around here. But I've done it, so it's alright. I mean, it's cool if you're going like clubbing or to a party or something, or if you're a YouTuber and you just want to look different in videos with your hair, you know, and not have to dye it or anything. Just clip these in, right, so. So I try and go as high as I can kind of thing. And then clip in, it's quite solid, it's not coming out. <laughs> Woo. I mean obviously I would sort of brush it a bit. The thing with these though, I mean luckily I've got quite long hair so this is kind of the same length of my own hair as you can see but if you've got you know short hair you can just snip 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 the bottom of it, do you know what I mean? Give it a little brush Oh, kind of mix it in a little bit more so it doesn't look so kind of block, do you know what I mean? Like it's more like naturally blending in with the hair, there you go I like that actually, it's pretty cool. Um, and then I could try another colour. What should we do? Should we do. We do. Actually, I really want to see what the yellow one looks like. This kind of reminds me, do you remember when Lady Gaga did, I think it was telephone video, I think. And she had like that yellow colour hair. I'm sure it was telephone if it's not. Mm. But yeah, it's a bit weird, the yellow. I don't know if I like it or hate it. I think I like it. I think it'll go well because my hair's black. So I think the yellow and black will go well. Right, let's. Get that off. So once again, it's just one of these ones. Okay, so I'm just going to take a section. Really, what would have been easier is if I would have had one of those, you know, the big bulldog clip things, like the hair bulldog clips, I don't know what they're called. So I could have kept that kind of sectioned off while I put that in. But it's only to show you what to do and stuff. Um, and how I kind of do it on the quick. And show you how cool these things are. But, yeah, if you're doing it like properly then I would suggest using those kind of clips to kind of, you know, you can section it better. Actually, I really like that. Look at that yellow. <laughs> no, I like that, actually. The black and yellow go really cool. I just want to go mad now. I'm just putting, like, loads. Um, sorry. But yeah, these are different, as I say. So these don't do that clippy thing. They're more like an actual slide. This is so much fun. I love doing, like, stuff with my hair. I'm a big kid. Um, yeah, it's like rainbow look. So I've got blue and yellow. I don't know. Maybe pink. So these literally just like a slide, like a hair clip. Just go in. Should I put one over here, maybe? No, I need to lift that bit up. <laughs> okay, so these are a little bit shorter, so maybe I should have put that lower, but for now it'll do. No, actually, I will put it lower because it looks a bit silly. And also, this is a secret that I do. Uh, sometimes when I wear wigs and stuff, in my videos, um, sometimes I wear different colour wigs just to be a bit different, you know. Um, what I do, if they don't sit very well at the top, I tend to put like a little hat over the top, like a little beanie hat or something, um, and that way it kind of hides that bump. Because like sometimes I've got wigs, they look really cool on the actual hair, um, but like the top of it just looks like this big kind of lumpy bumpy thing on the top of your head, like it doesn't lay well. Um, but if you wear a hat over that, don't recognise it, like you don't notice like you know, where it's gone a bit rubbish. So I'm going to clip that under there. It's like rainbow colour. Um, my bra strap's falling down. This is really irritating. I hate that when that happens. It's really irritating. 
um I think to be honest I mean these are cool because the different colors but I think I prefer putting them in in that kind of clippy way you know the the original ones more than like the slide but it don't matter it doesn't matter but can you see like literally you know under five minutes I've made my hair look pretty funky I think and a bit different than it did Yeah, and I, I don't like these as well because they're they're shorter, whereas these are like my own length. Um, what I'll do after I film this video, um, I'll take some selfies, selfie time, and I'll show you what it looks like. So you can see like the full length of it. Then I need to put more lipstick on as well because my lipstick is coming off. By the way, in case you're wondering what lipstick I'm wearing, it is Ego, <laughs> Ego, uh, Mad About Matt's W7 lipstick. It's purple, like a light purple. But I need to put some more on because. It looks like it's just kind of coming off a bit. Um, what else have I got here? I'm just going all out now. So this is the red. Um, as I say, like literally, just go on eBay and stuff like that. You can get them cheap. But I, I love this shop mixtures because they do so many cool things. And they're really nice to me. Like, I've been going in there for years. I can't open it. Um, I've been going in there for absolutely years now. And they're always friendly to me. They know that I've got a YouTube channel. Because um, I go in there and just like buy random things for the channel and uh, every time I go in there they're like how's your channel getting on and I, I'm like yeah it's good so no they're really nice people in there they do like jewellery they do makeup they do hair stuff they do a bit of everything really bright red so yeah I really prefer these ones these kind of clippy ones I haven't really got much space, but mind you, I've got that there. I'll put it over here. I don't know where I put it. <laughs> I'm going to put it up here. And by the way, it doesn't hurt when you clip them in. In case anyone's wondering, does it hurt when you clip them in? It doesn't hurt. I haven't pulled them out yet, so... No, it doesn't hurt. Like, these don't hurt to pull out, I don't think, because you just unclip them and they, you know, kind of come out easily. But I've got a feeling the ones that are a little bit like the slides might pull a little bit. But I don't know. We'll find out. There we go. There's the red. But it's pretty cool, don't it? I think it's pretty cool. Without hair dye or anything. Because the thing is, I love I love dyeing my hair. You know, I've, I've dyed my hair for years now. And, you know, it's always the same colour. I have to dye it black, you know. Um, in the past, I did kind of get a bit more adventurous. I was like a redhead for a while. I had blonde highlights put in. And the more I put lo lots of different colours in and bleach and that, it kind of ruined my hair a bit. So I kind of just stick to doing it like every few months, you know. Um, not as frequent as I used to. And only that kind of same colour, that black colour. Uh, so, you know, to kind of mix these hair extension things in, you can get that kind of wild look without having to use, you know, products, you know, of hair dye on your hair, basically. But yeah, I think my worst uh, hair colouring disaster was when I was at school. Um, and <laughs> I wanted, like, blonde highlights, and my mum done it, and it just come out like a weird, rustic orange colour. It was not good. It was, it was really horrible. Mm. It's bad. And another hair disaster I had, I went to this really flash hairdressers, which is ridiculous anyway, but I thought, oh, I'm going to go there, treat myself. And it was a really, like, expensive hairdressers. It is a famous name, so I'm not going to say it, but it's name of a, yeah, a product. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, I don't want to get into trouble. But, yeah, basically, I asked for blonde highlights, right, and they ended up, for some reason, just doing my fringe literally i kid you not i looked in the mirror once it was done because you don't really look when they're doing stuff you just sit there you get pampered i looked in the mirror and i had just like a blonde fringe and everything else was dark and i was like eh? terrible just really bad and then they had to die over it and yeah but yeah i think it's really cool i think it's a great way of kind of making your hair look funky and as i say uh thank you so much to natalie nightwolf for this idea uh she she really is great i'm, I'm not just saying it i watch a lot of youtubers right 
um, and some people I like more than others and she is up there top of the list for me I adore her I literally I want to hang out of her like if she lived in Essex I want to take her you know shopping and have a coffee take selfies she's just so wild and so fun and yet she also has videos where she opens up she's very you know honest and emotional she tells it how it is how she's feeling and she just lets you in her world like when I watch her videos it feels like I don't know, like, I just know so much about her. I feel like she's a friend when I watch her. I don't know, I just really like her, she's lovely. And she does all these like try-ons, um, which I think she's so like, she's, you know, so brave to do that, like clothes try-ons. Cause I do a few like, you know, hauls and then try-ons, you know, showing you what the clothes look like. Um, but she's like proper confident. I wish I could be that confident. I always feel a bit awkward when I'm kind of, this is my new jumper and this is my new dress. I always feel a bit awkward. Um, but she just looks like, so confident so cool doing it i need some of her confidence um but yeah go check out her channel she's amazing okay like seriously amazing um and yeah tell me what you think of the hair extensions obviously i haven't done them properly properly because i would have done it with a proper like mirror um but you can see kind of where i'm coming from with them and the idea of it so yeah I'll put some more lipstick on and then i'm gonna take a couple of selfies and add them on the end of the video Hold on, I'll pull this forward. Ooh. <laughs> Who just randomly does this in the middle of a video? Just puts lipstick on. Me! <laughs> I think I need a new one of these. It's getting quite, quite dry. Anyway, so <laughs> carry on watching for the selfies. Let me know what you think about these. And yeah, I think they're really fun. I really do. I just so I want to put one more in, don't I? But yeah, I would definitely recommend for myself and for yourself if you're going to do it, using like the little. Is that on? Hold on. Using the little. um things you know like the clips to separate your hair to put them put it up because it's a bit difficult when you're kind of trying to put this there and put that there and so if you could like separate where the hair is you could clip them in easier and use a mirror not just a camcorder thing like i'm doing but there you go okay thank you for watching everyone carry on watching for the selfies and don't forget please click like please comment please subscribe to my channel because that'd be awesome and what else yeah social media twitter at minxlaura123 instagram minxlaura123 and facebook is minx.laura.5 and one more thing before i go please check out my other youtube channel which is minxlaura123 asmr uh, on that channel i make relaxation videos to help people with anxiety insomnia some people when they watch my videos they get like a pleasant tingly sensation <laughs> that just sounds so weird but weird is good and it helps millions of people to you know sleep and relax and just you know yeah anyway i'm off now please subscribe to my channel and carry on watching for the photos <laughs>